THG here getting into a new game. Obviously, you can see what that is, but it might be a little misleading because of the advertisements. This is Doom 2016. Now, I had just played through this. As you can see, I unlocked, like, everything. Just, you know, preparing for this playthrough. Bye-bye. Oh, God, that hurt. Why did I do it? Because I'm starting a new one. Start campaign. And I'm going to play on ultra violence because hurt me plenty was fun although once you start unlocking things like you know your praetor suit and your weapon challenges the runes all that stuff it just becomes way too easy near the end so we're gonna go with ultra violence here and something that's kind of funny about doom 2016 is i've always loved the doom games i've even loved doom 3 but i didn't really get into it when it rolled around in 2016 and now that I'm, I've been do, making these videos for a couple of years, and I've s started to grow an appreciation for shooters and just games in general that do things that are kind of abstract or out of, that's not normal for today's gaming environment, like not having a reload function, as you don't hear. Just small things like that. And this game has a, yeah, you're going to have to deal with that mouse cursor in the middle of the screen. It just doesn't go away. Or until that pops up. But, uh, yeah, I've gained an appreciation for those types of games. And this is one of those games that I really enjoyed my playthrough. I had a very, very difficult time trying to figure out what I was going to rate this. I decided on good. Just because there were some annoyances I had with the game. That held it back from great. Brutal. Without mercy. But you. You will be worse. Rip and tear. Until it is done. Rip and tear. Until it is done. These chains can't hold me. It's a little pistol. gotta start off with something now why would the pistol just be laying there don't think about it too much that that demon was just kind of standing there staring at me like hey you don't really want to kill me I mean I'm, I'm a demon but I'm not that demonic I don't remember. Have to contain this. Yeah, I couldn't remember if she said anything there or not. Let me get reacquainted with the controls. Oh, there it is. The Praetor suit. I'm going to try to collect as many collectibles as I can. I'm not really that worried about the secrets, but I'm going to try to fully upgrade everything during this playthrough. It's not my entire focus, though. I'm certainly not going to show myself uh, spamming checkpoints to complete weapons challenges, though. That would not be very entertaining. Cannot determine the cause of the demonic invasion until the Resop satellite is brought back online. Welcome. I'm Dr. Samuel Hayden. I'm the head of this facility. I think we can work together and resolve this problem in a way that benefits us both. He's like, shut up, corporate asshole. Artifacts. Doom Marine. Additional relics were found on the tomb alongside the Doom Marine. Some incantation tablets and an ancient combat suit which was given a name. The Praetor Suit. When found, it was encased in an inscribed stone tomb. The suit was extracted from the rock, cleaned, and subjected to numerous tolerance tests. 
and found to be almost impervious to any damage. It appeared to have some mechanical function as well. Small receptors on the gloves and chest plate that attracted argent yeah, argent plasma and dissipated it through the capillary tubes in the substructure. Markings on the armor were also consistent with images of a man or humanoid, seen in several of the tablets and stones found on other expeditions. The same markings were also noted on a helix stone. Despite it being clear that the suit can be activated in some way, no method has been found to do it. It appears to be a missing component. Likely the Doom Marine himself. In the previous game, which would have been Doom 3, you were just a actual Marine. Quite human. In this one, you're like a super badass demon killer. Let me get reacquainted with the controls here. I just got done finishing off Terminator Resistance, which had a much, much slower term turn rate. Glory kills! Why? Because it's glorious! Don't ask questions, bitch! Fistfuls of fun. Hey! I don't think you need that anymore. Don't take it from my cold, dead hands! I just did. Combat shotgun. It's not a tactical shotgun. It's not a special op shotgun. It's a tactical shotgun. Because it's tactical. Demonic presence at unsafe levels. Lockdown in effect. What are you doing, Doom 2016? Well, you just go around punching demons in the face. Oh, yeah, I'm on that map that's kind of like below the rest of it. Oh, yeah, this is the, uh,. Tutorial map. I forgot about that. I'm not at the first level yet. Is there challenges for this one? No, but there's three secrets, an elite guard, and a field drone. That's the first thing I upgrade on my freighter suit. Where to find those secrets. Give me all you got, motherfucker! Nothing but bits. Running away, eh? When in doubt, pistol out. Hey, you got what I need over there. I'm coming to take it. Stop running away, you little fucker. I gotta blow up everything. Cause why not? I don't need anything else. Let me have a look-see around this room. I imagine I run into the, uh, field... What are they called? The field drone and the uh, freighter suit just walking through here. I don't think I'll need to look for it. He cannot be allowed to leave this place. She would ruin everything. She is one hideous woman. In just about every I'm willing to take imaginable way. I'm responsibility for the horrible events of the last 24 hours, but you must understand. Our interest in their world was purely for the betterment of mankind. Everything yeah, has clearly really made things better. Now, yes. But it was worth the risk. Was I it? You. I love the narrative to the game where certain humans are so will- well, certain humans in positions of power are so willing to do the most unethical things because they deem it necessary. That's the underlying theme throughout this game, and I totally agree with it. As history has shown, that happens time and time again. 
it doesn't matter how obscene their goals are or what they want to achieve, they'll find some way to justify it. I'm not going to read over every single pamphlet or thing I pick up. Boy, this place is infested with demons. I can't wait till I get that upgrade where uh, glory kills make demons drop armor when they die. So used to having double jump. They took it away! I can't kill you up there. Not a glory kill anyway. Ass bitch. <laughs> he was walking in the wrong direction. Just took a supercharged round to the back. God, that takes a long time. Things like super fast when it's upgraded, but there's like no point in using it then. Why use a pistol when you've got a BFG? Any armor lying around? I'll take that over here. Shotgun shells. No reloads. Because fuck reloading. This is doom. Rethink your paradigms. Oh, there's a secret around here. Hello, you. They're my little buddies. Oh, there it is. Couldn't remember what it came over here for. Blue key card. But we did away with key cards and stuff like that in shooters since at least, you know, 2004-ish. Oh yeah, well this is Doom. So fuck that. Fuck what you've done. I'm putting key cards in it. And I'm putting little collectible models. Fist bump. Oh, he doesn't do the fist bump there. Damn it. So disappointing. Blue guy. Open up, bitch. Hand grenades. There's just some really w weird looking hand grenades. Frag grenade. Yeah, the hand grenades in here kind of remind me of... You got the hologram on the far left, the siphon grenade in the middle, which is... I haven't really used it all that much, but I think it puts stuff into a staggered state. Then the hand grenade on the right. And the hand grenade on the right reminds me a lot. I mean, a lot. Of, um, the nectar grenades in the game Haze. If you've never played Haze, don't worry about it. You're not missing anything. If you really want to see why I said that, then you can just type Haze into my... Search my videos for Haze and find my playthrough of it. It was an overhyped game that turned out to be quite shitty. Even had a song from Korn back when they were at the top of their game. Or close to the top of their game. I thought that the top of their game was Untouchables, but that's debatable.
go around wrecking everything. Yeah, I thought that was an equipment recharge. It's kind of weird to see them lying around. They don't really have a place. Or at least in my opinion, they don't. Is this where I get the upgrade? No. Have a grenade, motherfucker. Auto map. Praetor suit upgrades. I don't have any tokens. Let's have a look see at the map. Oh yeah, we got the uh Praetor suit up ahead here. Or the Elite Guard token, whatever it's called. Praetor suit token. Area scanning technology, yep. It's the first one I'm getting. There goes the upgrade drone, taunting me. Alright, let's get in here and pull this lever. Get a secret. He's this big, strong, doom guy. And he has such a hard time with that lever. This imp was just staring at me like I'm a monkey in a cage. Yeah, they're not attacking me. It's like, hey. They kind of remind me of the, uh, the scamps from Oblivion, Elder Scrolls 4. Elf's dead. Yeah, old school doom level. High de oh, it just disappeared. I was gonna say highly detailed characters and models up against the backdrop of what was a 1990s game. I grew up playing the original Doom and Wolfenstein 3D and Duke Nukem and Hexen. I thought there was something over here to pick up. Guess not. Here's the upgrade robot. Give me that shit, bitch. Charge burst or explosive shot. I'll take that. I love that upgrade. He just punches the drone. Like, thanks. Now get the fuck out of my way. Yeah, there is. You little fucker. So early in the game, always running out of ammo. Weird-looking health packs. I'm just saying, they look funky.
kind of look like PC cases, except for the uh, cylindrical ones. Bloop. Come on. There you go. Oh, you bring it. Coward. Don't want to face the Doom guy. Totally gibbed. Who's smacking me? I've got low he elf. Oh yeah, I forgot about that dude. I just about walked right by that one. How do I get to him? Where'd I see it? Oh yeah, there you are. Oh shit. Wait, huh? Alright. I thought, is there some sort of a ledge down here I haven't discovered yet? Ah, gotta get, uh, gotta get that little model. I went to hit jump, but it didn't really take. Oh. Pick it up. Fist bump. Oh, he's just looking at it like I hate collecting these fucking things. Data log back there. I don't care about that. Red. Oh, there you are. Couldn't find you. Heard him shooting, but you just die. Oh, I got everything on this level. No need to explore any further. Shotgun ammo would be like really cool. Oh, there's some. Oh, there you are. I'm gonna smack you around. Curb stomp. This ain't Gears of War. Why is there curb stomping? Because Gears doesn't own the rights to curb stomping, bitch. Curb stomping is for everybody. 
I gotta blow them up. Gotta blow that up too. Gotta blow everything up. It's all gotta go. Welcome to the UAC. Now 221 accident free days. Yeah, I think your system needs updated. Alright, that's the end of this video.